Welcome to the first video from Excel Data Analysis Series PQB or Power Query Basics. This is video PQ00. We are going to look at the series structures and the topics that we are going to discuss. So the first set of topics will be an introduction to Power Query. We'll discuss why we should use Power Query and where we can find Power Query and a quick overview about Power Query Editor and how it works. The second set of subjects will be about the different sources of data and we will focus on only two sources. First source is Excel, the same workbook or other workbooks and also we'll look at how we can get data from CSV or text files and then we are going to look at where we can load the data. It can be into tables and sheets inside Excel can be directly to pivot tables and pivot charts and also to data model. We'll not focus on data model in this series, however, we'll work with it and we'll have a quick overview about what we can do with the data model and Power Query together. And then the biggest part of this series will focus on Power Query as a data transformation machine. And in this section, we're going to look at how we can deal with rows and columns, how we can work with different data types, dates, text, and numbers, and how we can append our data. We'll have a quick look at merge queries. And finally, how we can summarize data using the group by functionality. And the last section will be about enriching data. It will discuss how we can add columns, how we can add formulas and calculation. And finally, we'll look at how we can manage our queries. We'll look at how we can duplicate the query or how we can reference a query or how we can change the source of the query so we can use it in different projects. And now let's quickly discuss the strategy of this series regarding the length of the video. We'll try to make sure that we're not exceeding 10 minutes for each video. Regarding the topics, we'll try to cover only one topic at a time. And regarding the style of the video, it will be more practical and will include a short example or a project in each video. But every now and then we'll take a pit stop, we'll look at the topics that we covered and we'll try to find a project or an example that covers a larger uh, bit of the course. So this, uh, this video in, in this case will be a bit longer than 10 minutes. And also we'll try to attach all the files, all the working files below videos and expectation for number of videos for this series will be somewhere between 15 and 20 videos and what's next will take the next level pqi or power query intermediary before leaving you if you didn't subscribe to the channel yet please make sure that you hit the subscribe button so you get notified with the new videos and also like this video and leave a comment and believe me i'm reading all the comments and try to make sure that i take into consideration any feedback coming from my audience so thank you very much for your time and see you in next video pqb01